watching ESPN's Championship Week. North Florida versus USC Upstate. A great atmosphere, electric environment. Both teams playing to punch their ticket to the big dance. Tom Hart alongside Mo Cacera. Hi everybody, Kevin Connors, Mo Cacera, Ryan Rucco alongside Mo Cacera. Welcome back to Sports Center, everybody. Mo Kassara calling this game. Joining us now live from Jacksonville. First sellout in school history. What is the anticipation like there for this game? You can barely hear and hear the students were lined up out front of the building. Beautiful atmosphere, two teams trying to get in the big dance. If you're coaching in this game, you want your team to play within themselves, stick to your game plan that's worked all season. It's going to be hard to beat Kentucky. One of the things about Kentucky on a night where they may not shoot well or maybe not have the best night overall, they can dominate a game defensively and their defensive presence is just tremendous. Okay, Duke versus Michigan State. You know, is this kind of like the appetizer to the bigger game coming up after that? Well, we've got the big stage and the yeah. big coaches. Coach K and Coach Izzo in the first game is certainly going to be very excited. What are your thoughts? What makes those players so special this year for Kentucky? What they have is length. They've got great length, great size, and Coach Calipari does a wonderful job of building those guys and playing them in an NBA style game. So he's developing them as they mature and their talent is just through the roof. Great players make all of us coaches look good. Russ Smith, I love the way that he leads his team and makes Louisville better. Taking advantage of that ball screen, Rutgers doesn't handle it well, tack the rim. Former McDonald's All-American local product, using that big strong body, playing around the basket, using his size and strength. Coach, your kids battled all night. How'd you attack that zone that bothered you a little bit in the second half? We didn't attack it very well, I would tell you. One of the teams I really like, VCU. Shaka smart, their team's playing well, incredibly tough place to play. I love the Rams. I like the way that Temple has hit the offensive glass, and I really like the way that UCF has made that extra pass. They've thrown the ball ahead. They've done a nice job of shooting the ball from the perimeter, but a lot of that comes out of that extra pass that they've made and running some good offense. Great coaches in this league. Kevin Ollie doing a wonderful job up at UConn, and Mick Cronin. What tremendous defense they play, the Cincinnati Bearcats. Rick Pitino, a master in March. Gambling defense reaching two reaches there by South Florida, and then no box out. Woo, thought he was in the rim. Great block, great transition defense. Way to stay with the play. Antoine Mason, one of the best in the country. It's like a freight train going down the middle of the court. Tough to stop. Billy Barron comes back. Our two featured one-on-one -on -one guys. Chance for a three-point opportunity. Nice extra pass. Get the easy layup, take the lead. When you're trying to find ways to win, especially on the road, draw up a quick set play out of a timeout or out of an out of bounds. Coach Finney runs a little circle action here. One player through, second guy steps up into an open area. He's so efficient, you know, he's just compact. He doesn't waste any energy or effort, and he has a great ability to finish. Thanks a lot, Mo. Enjoy the game. Thank you. Appreciate it.